Hi everybody, it's Julie, and I am here today. Uh, this is my first embellishment day for the brand new August Little Golden Book Junk Journal Challenge. We're using the ABC format, so we have things from A to Z to make, and we have a list of things from A to Z to use. And so I'm really excited to get started. I'm going to start with an embellishment rather than taking the book apart because this week I have my granddaughter and I need to do what I can do when I can do it. So we're going to start with the Embroidery Lace Card Large Tag Make 2. Now, if you actually have some of these um, lace cards, you can use those in your journal um, they do need to have some type of yarn or something going through it um, I'm going to show you how I'm going to make mine so my little golden book that I've chosen is the jungle book and so it has some great images and to go along with this I have made a digital kit I'm hoping to get to show you the digital kit at the end of the video today because um, it's out there printing right now um, I have this image that was sent to me and I might use that I have this fun book of cinnamon synonyms synonyms and antonyms and homonyms that I I traded out some books at the free library for these but I'm thinking, look at this. That looks like it is ready to be the back of a card. So I have that. I have this old dictionary was there also. And so I may, I may use that. Okay. Um, I have printed out this page, the lion and the tiger page page. Um, I have the draft. I don't know if I'm going to use that or not. I have this really cool yarn that I have been saving. It made me think of in the wild, in the jungle, probably just because of that piece of fabric right there that is on here. I have a large needle, okay? And I have a dryer sheet, I have this. I'm not sure what all I'm gonna be using. I do have my, um, my punch here and I have it set so that the the guards are all the way back so whichever one that I use I don't know if you know but there is a guard on here if you want to go along and punch a hole and a bunch of holes and you want them all to be at the same place there is a guard on here that you can use to um, to be able to do that and then, of course, if you want to open it all the way, then you pull your guard all the way back. Okay. Okay. So this is embroidery lace card, a large tag. We're making two. I'm going to use this page. And so to start off with, I'm going to go ahead and cut this page in half. Okay. Um, the book that I used to make this digital was actually the pages didn't come out to be the right size for a page. So to get this whole image, I did the um, picture pages. Okay, so I have this box. It came from Grove. And I'm thinking I can use... Um, these pieces okay so there's two of them you see that okay so trash this would be trash so um, this time you have to use four things have to be happening to your embellishment. This time your base can be one of the four things. Your Dear Julie Julie digital can be one of the four things. You just have to use each of the items 
We call them elements because they're the things we're using to make the items. Um, so we're calling those elements, A to Z. And those are the animals, book pages, chalk or eyeshadow, dictionary envelopes, and so on. And we have, for the letter T, we have trash. And so I think this box would count as trash. We're straight across here, so I can go ahead and use that to go ahead and get a nice straight edge here maybe if you can't get it to start go down a little bit push your push your blade in go up and then back down just like I did there okay now um, I'm gonna want to have my book out and decide I kind of like that um, I kind of like that look but I want I don't want it to stick out the top, I don't. Well, it could stick out the top a little bit. I'm going to clean it up a little bit, though. Okay, so I'm going to come over here and clean that up. It had kind of a mess going on up there. So if I were to take that. Now, I do need to take into consideration. I think we'll go in that direction. Because I need to be able to reach in with my um, punch to get my holes because I'm going to make a card. I don't have any of those. I do have some somewhere. I have some Valentine lace cards somewhere. Um, they're not jungle and I, I really at this moment do not know where they are. Okay, so let's go ahead and clean up the other one. And so all I'm doing is making sure that I'm straight. And then I'm going to come in and do the same thing here. Again, I'm using trash. I'm using the trash box. Okay. And um, let's see. I wanted to... <laughs> I had the book out to make sure that I didn't make it too big. So I'm going to cut to about here. Which will give me a nice piece for a tag as well. It's a nice thickness, okay? It's not super thick, but it's a nice thick, okay? It's a nice thick. It's a nice thickness, okay? So let's go ahead and we'll mark this one. Let's mark it with my fingernail and cut, okay? So I'll have those that I can use later. have these okay so if this was in here yeah I like that just for something different okay but I think I want to <laughs> think I went around this corner up here oh I like that kind of looks like a 50s <laughs> like a sign like the Las Vegas sign it makes me think of okay okay so there we go I like that very much okay so on my lion I've got my um, my light behind here. So let's go down. You know what? Let's let's go ahead and fold this. If I fold that, then I know where the bottom should go. I'm going to fold it right at the white. Okay. I guess we could have just cut it. So I remember these cards and I remember them having like a little bit about 
whatever it was. And sometimes, like if you were going to lace around the lion, it might be, um, it might have other things going on in the picture as well. Okay, I'm going to just go around. I just want to make sure that I'm, I'm making it so I can see the... Yeah, okay. So it's going to fit on there. Perfect. Okay, so now I do have a little haul from Spectrum Art Creations. I picked up this Tombow Mono Liquid Glue and the glue stick and this Cosmic Shimmer um, Specialist Acrylic Glue. So I'm going to be, I think this is the glue that you use on like shiny stuff. And um, so I need to go back. I'm going to go back and write, re-watch Spectrum Art Creations, um, the sale from not this last weekend, but the weekend before where she was talking about the different kinds of glues and um, see which one is for which for which. Because apparently I was, um, well, I was impressed. I was like, okay, yeah, I want, I need that because I need to try it. Um, so, and then I got one of their special, um, uh, stencils. So look at this stencil. Isn't this cool? And I, I thought it was, you know, just gave the illusion of being wild animal-ish. Now this right here, you could use that at Halloween. It almost looks like a spider web. And you've got dots and squares and just all the different things. But it to me, it looked wild, wild animal-ish. So I did purchase that to use with, um, with this uh, challenge. So I want to try the glue stick. Okay. It's permanent. It is. It's permanent washable. And it's... Tombow, you know I love the Tombow, so we'll see. Ooh, nice and juicy. Okay, so I'm just going to go ahead and put it on here. Okay, Mr. Lion, you're going right on here. Now I did have out some time cards to put these on. Um, but the time cards didn't really fit any of the criteria. And I'm really trying to use things that, that will count towards my items. So I'm going to glue that down and go around it. Okay, so just okay. So this gives me my lace, the tag part, the background. Okay, now I wanted to add a couple of things to this. Uh, one of the things is rub-ons. So. Um, in the challenges, I do count your rub-ons as a sticker, okay? So if you have um, rub-ons and you want to use them, they do count as a sticker. So we did discover, I don't want to do it again on these. Um, on the rub-ons, I want to cut them. I don't want to... Um, after the big mistake on the flamingo thing. Okay, so I'm going to cut out one of these. Okay, and I'm going to put it down here towards the bottom. I want to line it up. And then I'll go ahead and put it down. I don't have a popsicle stick or anything right here. Out. So, you know what? Let's try. Okay. 
Okay. And pull. Okay. I like that. I think that looks very, um, oh, we got a little. Make sure that that is down. Let's, let's make sure we put the top on this. Okay. Um, so that gives me sticker, digital, trash. And this is your pen, and I don't remember where this counts, but we'll, could be my, oh, I know, this was my you pick. Okay, so my, so I'm going to go around the outside with the gold pen. Oops. I'll just come down here and make the bottom gold pen thicker. Okay. So there, we've gone around the outside edge with the pen. Then I do have this sticker as well. And I'm just going to put this to be a little bit longer than the other little thing. We'll have it come in off the edge and across. And that gives us that gives us that. Okay? Okay. I love it. So now I need to go around my lion and we're going to see how far in I can get with my, okay, so that one only goes in that far. I have this one. This one cuts really, I mean, it gives you big holes though, but you know what? I, I think I like it because it's it's deeper and I'm gonna check one more time yeah this other one I thought this other one was deep as well but you see how far in I can go with this um, but it's going to be uh, they're like five sixteenths five sixteenths so a little over a quarter of an inch but look at here I can go all the way to the side of my lion in here okay so you might want to mark where you want to put your holes I'm going to use the gold pen <laughs> okay so let's go here and here and here Okay, now you can just go ahead and use a pokey tool and poke in those holes if you want to, okay? So you can just go ahead and use your pokey tool and have your holes. That way you don't have to worry about how far it goes through. Now, somebody was saying they have... Um, a stack of lace cards and so hopefully they will share those in 
the Facebook group so that we can see them to get an uh, you know a true idea. Like I said, this was I was trying to think of things that were childlike and fun. And the lace cards was one of the things I thought of. So the two that you make for the challenge um, need to have the string in them. But you could go ahead and make some others for your tags. Okay. And you can just lace it through, or you can do the, you know, the backstitch kind of lacing so that it is, um, framing or outlining your, whatever it is that you're doing. You can do something really simple. You can just do shapes if you want to. Okay. But there I have it. Okay. So a lace card. A lace card. Okay. Then I have my giant needle. And I'm not gonna I'm not gonna use the big holes. Okay. I'm gonna put those away. I'm gonna hopefully this will work though, because I have this funky funky yarn here but it's so cool okay I think if we wish me luck here you guys the lace cards always came with a like a plas plastic needle okay We'll start here. Yeah, we might want a bigger hole. We want a bigger hole. Definitely. Okay. So, let me see. Your, your yarn, you might not need a bigger hole, but I need the bigger hole. See if I can do it with the smaller bigger hole. A smaller bigger hole. Okay, I can get to that one. And I can get to this one. I can't see. Coming down here so I can see you guys. These ones I can't um, get in. I'm gonna go in and make them bigger with my with my pokey tool. Let's try from this this way. Nope. Can almost get there. I think we'll just pretend. I think we can get there. Yeah. Look at there. Okay, so all you have to do is um, have you have to have some of your string on it. Okay, so I'm going to start up there at the top like I showed you. I have an idea. 
I have an idea. Okay. Oh, look at there. I can do that. If I can get it through the holes, right? Okay, so I want to go through here. It says no. Okay, here we go. Going through the hole. I need to grab that fluff. Look at there. Look at there. Okay. So I'm going to let that hang off. Okay. So then we're going to lace. Sew through the lace card. doing this and I'll be right back. Okay, so I have gone through all the larger holes, okay? And I am going to go ahead and make sure that I've pulled this tight like I want. And then I'm going to wrap this around. I don't know about you, but whenever I used to play with these with the kids and they didn't quite get them finished, I would wrap them around and um, for later. Because sometimes, you know, sometimes they just, they were done. <laughs> okay, and I'm going to tie this. So I have used yarn, which is our Y. I've used um, hoarded stickers. Okay, we can do this. <clears throat> I'm gonna tie it to this piece right here. Okay, and I believe you'll still be able to write on the back of this. Okay, now if, if it's too fluffy, and I think it is, I'm going to go in and just cut, cut those a little. Yeah, we'll save these two pieces there fabric but not the fuzz don't need to save the fuzz okay so there is my okay and then I have this it made me think of a crown so um, this came this was in Sally's uh state sale stuff it, it almost feels like it's been spray painted you guys I don't know of course she's not here for me to ask so but it feels like it is spray painted I'm just going in to 
clear the glue, I took the weekend off. We <laughs> drove through a horrible rainstorm. I can't even believe that we we drove through that. Um, on our way to meet Izzy um, and her mom and her other grandma. And um, so we met them and then it took them it took them eight two hours to get to where we were. We were stuck in traffic and they all decided that we would meet them at the rest stop. So we turned around and went met them at the rest stop. It took them eight hours to get home. It took them two hours to get where we were and eight hours to get home. It was so crazy. There was a an accident, a big rig. When they went by it the other way, it was on fire. They had just gotten the fire out. Okay, I'm just waiting for the fabric tack, you know. Always waiting for the fabric tack. And that I need to clear out the the tip. It's it has a blockage. Maybe this isn't the one I thinned. Nope, that's not the one I thinned. This is the one I got ready. Sorry about that, you guys. See, that was okay. So we're gonna put this up at the top like it's a crown. You need to hold it down. Okay, so I'm going to be doing another one of these. And that will be my two. This is what you see from the other side. So you can go ahead and you can write on that side. You'd be able to write even easier if I took some, some of this trash. just put it right here okay so that's the corrugated from a corrugated box and that will give us some lines okay corrugated okay so we use some ink that is I inks and sprays Okay, so we used lace, we used yarn, we used inks and sprays, we used trash. I have a little, I, I did this from my phone and it printed on copy paper so I have the list small. And so we can go ahead and mark those things off. Let's see. We used fabric and lace. We used hoarded stickers, ink, um, yarn. Uh, you pick one item, it's the gold pen. And trash, QRS. Wow, we did good. We've used six of our 26 items already. And of course, we'll use those again and again. Um, I'm going to go ahead and do this other one real quick. And we'll be back. And we'll have two done. Yay! Well, we'll have one thing done, but two of them. Okay, be right back. And here's the other one. And this time I laced the back of the tiger and we still have the holes here i did the um 
I was going to call it the tattoo, uh, the rub on and the sticker here. I did go ahead and I had put this on ahead of time. So um, the thing about this is you do have a place that you could put something and hold it back here as well. So, um, yeah, now I didn't, I didn't add the lace to this one. I think that the lace is too big actually, um, which, you know, there's an easy fix for that. We'll just cut the lace, cut the lace down. Okay. So, yeah, I like that much better. You know, I want it. I, I want it to, to. Yeah, there. We'll add that piece, and we'll use the, the faster one. That's not the faster one. Or yep, it is. Sorry. Faster fabric tack, faster. Okay, so. Okay, so um, after the video has premiered, come back and tell me which um, elements or embellishments you want to see me do first. And I will try as long as um, I have the time and everything uh, this week. It's just going to depend on what me and the granddaughter are doing. This is our first time having, I well, you know, I had her in January, just me by myself. And we did great. And so now tonight is our night out in our little town sponsored by the sheriff department so we're gonna go and check that out we might get to go um, to the park if the splash pad is working take, I might take her over there and let her splash around on the splash pad I have to go to the post office um, today so there we go okay so we have lions and tigers we used trash we used ink we used yarn we used lace we used a dear Julie Julie digital um, I think these turned out really cool so these are our embroidery lace card large tag and we needed to make two and so I think these are going to be a great addition into my little golden book and I'm actually thinking because I like the way they um, they look I'm thinking I can take this okay so this was the back of the stencil or the packaging for the stencil from Spectrum Art Creations. I can go ahead and take that out. I can, um, I think I can use this. Let's push that up. It's a little bit bigger. I think we can make this a clear pocket. Or two, two clear pockets. Okay. And let's see if we use this one as a clear pocket. We might have to come in and put something over that, but. I can I can do that. Okay, so that would be that pocket. Okay. 
him. Yeah, I like that. So we don't lose those images. Okay. And we'll we'll end up putting something over this. Um, I will I'll start looking. Okay. And this could go behind this and be a second. Yeah, look at there. That could go behind it. I love it. And we used up all the trash. Okay, so we've got a little bit of trash there. Good glue is closed. Pin is closed. Put our pokey tool back. And I'm going to show you what I what printed <laughs> from the new um, Zoo Animal Digital. This can be used for circus, jungle, zoo, vacation. Um, let's check it out. And here we go. So I printed the tags, the postcards and wallets, some of the pages, the... Um, I did not print the ephemera yet. I will print the ephemera and show you that. And the book, there's actually um, all the book pages from the book with a the side-by-side -side is an empty page. And so I will print those out for you and show you those tomorrow, <laughs> okay? So here we have the lions and tiger and the elephant. These are the large tags, and these can be used as large tags. You can, you know, cut them up and have them be tags, or they can be used as pages in a traveler's notebook size style journal. You can also um, use them as a border tuck. Lots of lots of ways you can use use these. So those are the large tags. That is one of my favorite parts about a Dear Julie Julie Digital is the large tags. Remember we did make this little journal during the VIP, which all the VIPs for June received this 63 page digital as their gift. They also got the background, um, most of the background pages before I ended up separating. And so I'll show you that kit tomorrow. The background, um, it should be in the Etsy shop uh, today. So uh, it has a variety of backgrounds. So I was trying to, gonna show you. So this is from one of the large tags. This is the large tag made into a flip page, and it's been backed by the other. Okay, um, so so these are the postcards done um, smaller. So we'll, we'll show you the postcards, and then we'll show you that at the end. So this is the Lion and Tiger wallet page. Okay, so lion and tiger wallet page. This is the lion postcard page. This is the one of the other animal postcard pages in the portrait. So you can cut this in half and make these be small pages in a regular size journal. We have wallets of all the different animals. And here we have the lion and tiger page um, postcards again you can cut it here if you're just you know you just want the lion because you're doing um, Wizard of Oz there you go so there's that so we have the elephant family and the lion family and here's the elephant family and the lion family the mixed page there some of the other images from the book. We even have a sea lion. More postcards. And that's the mini postcard. So this is the background piece, uh, 
pages from the background. Okay, so here's uh, some of the pages. We've got it with a little border over here. Lions, tigers, and elephants. <laughs> and I did the deer together on one. So you can use that in your wildlife journals. Or there's your bear. Tiger. The lion and tiger face, the lion and elephant, and all the animals. Okay, so again, there's still an ephemera page that has envelopes and the library pocket and stuff like that. And there is also the book. Okay, so pages from the book and the mini journal. So I will hopefully be able to get those printed and show you tomorrow. I was having trouble with my printer, so I'm behind. I'm always having trouble with that printer. It's me. It's not the printer. It's me. Okay, I love these. These are the embroidery lace card large tag make two. And we made two of them. And then we used the packaging from my new stencil and we have pockets already ready for them and we have this black card. Okay, so little golden book. Are you excited? Have you started? Did you pick out your little golden book? Um, make sure you go check out the details video for this challenge. The It is... Um, the link is listed in the detail in the description box down below. Follows directions in that video. Join us. We'd love to have you. The deadline for this challenge is August 31st, so there's still lots of time. Find something to celebrate every day. Have an amazing day. Don't forget the digitals, um, the Christmas digitals, the zoo digitals, and all of the tropical and flamingo digitals are on sale for 50 percent off in the dear julie julie etsy shop check that out have a great day i'll see you tomorrow bye bye bye